Welcome to episode 17. So, it looks kind of pretty, doesn't it? But it's not that finished yet. There's some stuff to do. First of all, um, we need to push towards Pakistan as well as India over here. We also have um, some minor concerns here in Siam. And this offensive doesn't go as well as planned. Which is probably mostly due to the lack of uh, appropriate technology. We're sending them into into combat with really, really um, ancient arms. So we need to sort that out. That will happen by itself though. Because the amount of reinforcement needed will drop at some point. Well, at least that's what I'm hoping for. Um, I already did put the checkboxes in here after loading the safe. And I did go through these here and changed one of the setups. Not much uh, that is not well known to regular watchers of uh, this playlist. Yeah, also industrial production and efficiency are really important so that we can finally build infrastructure and liberate parts of uh, Indonesia. There's some combat going on here. And apparently we want... Tanyenda, where is that? Well, it doesn't matter. This all looks fine. If they go in here, you can move forward. And they are no longer needed either. Same as everyone else around here. We sank somebody. Let's have a look at this. Okay, we want this battle. We want the battle of Tom Tomatai too. And we want the battle of Charat. Okay, this is here. So I think the ones towards Japan are much more interesting though. This is not great. Doesn't look great, we probably should avoid that. Can we bump this? This might be out of uh, out of reach of the interceptors. I will try that. I usually have an airbase here in Hohot if I play this. So that's on me. Can we stop this for a second? Yeah, he's going back. No surprises there. These interceptors do not have an order for some reason. How about intercepting here? Okay, and we won another battle. And Baishang here. This is getting awfully stretched for them, isn't it? That's good. Let's see what got finished. Garrisons. We always need garrisons. So, in particular we need to secure the coast against Japan. Much more reasonable now. In this area, we can also argue, argue that there's an army needed. Maybe. Well, needed is a bit of a stretch. But it's definitely useful. So we can put an army HQ here. Just call it Wuxi. There is an army. Put somebody in here. It might be helpful. I, I guess logistics never hurts, right? And put them... Um, 
Hello. Is this one full? Oh. Yeah. That's not how, the, how I intended it. So this can remain here. All of these can be detached. He can be attached. Yeah, that's on me. I guess the game is not that intelligent just yet, and it probably never will be. Um, so what happened was I attached a lot of uh, simple garrisons to this HQ. Okay. I hate losing transports, especially if it's for nothing. Let's have a look over here. Is there anything that happened? Barely. This is all fine. That's okay too. We'll probably push them pretty soon. They are going over here. We need that one. Well, they are trying to get over here. And at this point, all of a sudden, there's forces there. We cannot get over here because there's a river. Sure, you can have energy. And we won another battle somehow, it seems. Both of these ground attacks work just fine, currently. So they must be out of reach of the bombers, uh, of the bombers, of the interceptors. They are not within reach here. Yeah, that's a problem. Let's relocate them. Down here. There's another, another bomber uh, wing though. So I'm perfectly happy if they just do regular ground attacks in here. Okay. Well, I guess in that case... Take these. Put them over here. Could make a difference. And now... They don't have the range due, uh, range due to technical disadvantage. They do not have fuel tanks, I guess. Medium fuel tanks. The other ones... Do. They were built as... Um, I think we water licensed here. That explains it. Okay, none of these... There's 16 in here, so an additional garrison is needed. We're getting awfully close to the 800 different brigades, too. 742. We're getting there. Still no upgrades produced, uh, none whatsoever. No. There will be additional resources over here, as well as industrial capacity. I know where this convoy was sunk, thank you very much. And we do produce additional convoys. I just think our convoys will not last until then. So that will not help. We can try to move out here. You know what, let's do that. This is probably Japan, and it's likely to be a submarine. If it's a big fleet, we are not in the best shape. 
Nothing found. Well, great. Intercept now that you are attacking. Will we get there? Can you stop sinking or... Okay, we got attacked. Well, that shouldn't be a problem anymore. There we go. That's resolved. This is not great. They are getting attacked, right? By whom? Oh, from down here. Okay. That should be easy. There's a lot of troops in here. We'll do this, won't we? Man. Oh yeah. They came from here. I see. And now the ones that go over the river can probably... We can probably... Remove this. That will be hard pressed to win. It did finish the combat in the other province though, so that's fine. We can leave this immediately. Who got attacked? This here. Seems like it. Yeah, that's not good. We do have air support though, at least. Okay. So all of these troops can probably move over here. Same as them. Let's push through. It doesn't matter. Down here. And do something like this. Get them in here. Support attack from here. And in case um, they fall us into the back, we can just uh, attack them too. Over here. Uh, I think the available convoys are in the single digit now. Yeah, eight. There's barely any progress in land doctrines. For some reason. Well, that shouldn't be a problem anymore. It's all fine. You guys over here, are you moving? Apparently, you don't. Well, what? Fine. That will be a province that is hard to keep. I drove back some of the mountaineers. Not good. We have won the battle though. We will keep this province.
Yeah, okay, well. That's probably not one of the attacks that we are fearful of. Let's look into Siam. So... Hmm. Chance of reinforcement is not great here. This is all good. They are really slow. Yeah, this unit in particular can probably be strategically redeployed. I think these two. As long as we get into the province fast enough. Because these will not leave the province prior to them arriving, right? That should be much faster. So, that'll be kept. I'm also kind of fearful about, uh, about the fleet down here. Where is it? Still trying to intercept. Well, I see. They are hunting a submarine, though. So, pardon my manners, but if we find that sub, we will definitely drop something on their head. Just like in that last episode where a subscription button dropped on my head. I will not do it today, though. Um, video editing is a pain. I will try to avoid that. So, um, in case you need, you know, to be told how YouTube works, subscriptions help, apparently. You know that well, uh, I, I think you know that way better than me, though. So... Ooh, it seems like the English are coming to help. This is not good. This is not good at all. We will refraud him, everyone. The entire, the entire forces here have a problem. What are you guys doing? I think this is buggy. And I think this is useless from their side. Can we get in here? Sure. So, assuming... The HQ leaders are much more important to me. So why not give them some combat experience? If we can. Put all of these... forward. Let's synchronize their arrival. There's cavalry in there. These units are... They should be capable. And we will not use the militia. Militia should be better defensively. Oh, neither we will use this militia core. The infantry core? Sure. The mountaineers can have a, a rest. Or defensive duty. However you want to put it. So let's support the attack here too. This should be an easy one. Well... At first glance, at least. Reinforcement chances are up to 2%. That's not bad. For you, it's 10 whiff. We have a whiff of 20 down. We will give them what they deserve. That's okay. There's the victory points in here. Oh, we claimed one. So we, we gotta make some progress down here. And it does not seem like this is happening. So let's forget about that. This province... We will probably push down here, though. Maybe alongside the river. These provinces don't matter much, do they? So he might as well go forward. I don't know if they regenerate um, organization, the ones withdrawing right now. They are more or less in.
And these forces will probably get in there. So we can move forward here. Yes. Yes, that should definitely help. It's also 137% at this point. So, I'm not trying to reduce this too early. So, let's put it on 6, maybe. Here we are. Which results in a lot more research. And, as you know, doctrines are always good to have. Because they do not need to be upgraded anymore. We can also have all of this, I think. It's 1940, uh, 1940 after all. Naval strike tactics? Sure. Uh, probably this too. We, even, we, we have naval bombers, so I guess we need that. That's a lot of stuff. And assuming that Japan doesn't fall easily, which usually it doesn't, we need additional naval bombers. A lot of them, actually. I just don't want to build another 50 naval bombers whilst uh, we have a problem with upgrades. So we need to expand. There should be industrial capacity. That finishes in two weeks. All right. We have won the Battle of Longhua. Where is Longhua? That's this one. And the one of Waichang. That's this one. That's an defensive battle, isn't it? Yeah, it's not perfect. But it's something. This looks risky to me. So maybe we can use one or two of these. Maybe an HQ too. Uh, that one's better. And put it back here. Try to help the ones in uh, Tomortai. Tomortai. And this one up here. He bombed whatever was left out of them. Can we... Yeah, that seems reasonable, right? Let's expand the ground attacks a little bit. Hopefully that will not cover territory that is uh, available to their interceptors. And if it is, we will find out pretty soon. That should be easy. He's one of the leaders that I really fear. He's one of the best ones. Oh. By Leon Trotsky. Another garrison. Still not getting there. We need too many reinforcements right now. Wherever that came from, uh, comes from. I don't know. I'm certainly not responsible for that. Oh, come on. Leave him alone. On the other hand... For now, they are doing well defending. Well, emphasis on for now. I'm actually starting to think that we need additional forces here to form some sort of defensive line. Even though they are out of organization right now. I'll just put him to the HQ. Do we have anyone with defensive? Just put it to a highest skill, which is one. Without traits, obviously, because this is a garrison. But I'm starting to think they might help you. Well, emphasis on might. Okay, we lost that one. That's not good.
Maybe we can get the CM situation sorted though. This is mountains. Why did I assemble everyone here? And you too. Can you get down here, please? Well. Okay, whatever. What's happening over here? That's not bad. They can probably push forward. This will not change much. They will get through this anyway. They are going away and this is useless. Keep them here. There. I want to turn circle them. But I think this might not be possible. What we can do though is push everyone in here. Give them some support from here. Like this. Oh, the militia arrived. Oh, one of them anyway. And I think, yeah, like this, I cannot combine them. This is one of these weird hearts of iron things. There good terrain for mountaineers anywhere here. Well, up, up front. If we push them up all the way. Up here. So I guess we can take them. Push them over here. And try to get into... Whatever this is. Chifeng. Okay, I like that. So, this is still Pakistan. Same as this, India commences somewhere around here. This is still Pakistan. We do have, oh no, we do not have a land connection with, uh, with Afghanistan. Not that it matters much. That shouldn't be a problem. No ground attacks anymore? Oh, this is the wrong... That's the wrong bomber fleet. They're still waiting for the upgrades. This is interceptors. And they are resting. For now. Bulgaria wants... No. I don't want to buy your fuel. Neither the one of Prussia. This is not Japan. This is Netherlands. How dare you. Can you stop? Can you stop intercepting somewhere out there? Just move them back in. I don't want to meet the Japanese. Especially not an aircraft carrier. Hmm. Seems like organizations dropping here. Please stop it. Well, it'll sort itself out. Either we will have additional convoys, or we will not have any convoys anytime. Soon, so it doesn't matter anymore. There's militia in here. This is woods. At most. We can support from here. 
try to get in there. If I can select the correct unit status. Yeah. So the garrisons don't do anything. These three go support attack. You all. You all try to get in here. And Chiang Kai-shek comes along for additional experience. He's at level 3 now. He's level 4. Well, they will probably not go towards the gar garrison. And this stack is... I wouldn't say it's going places, but they might have a chance, especially with the HQ. Well, the HQ doesn't matter. It doesn't fight. So, Japan is uh, awfully close. Gotta be honest here. I did plan for this to go a bit smoother, but to be fair, it's expected. Um, if we do not, uh, if we do not upgrade our forces, this is what happens. This is just technical, technological inferiority. And once that is settled, which may take quite a while, um, we will see differences. We can also um, optimize organization regain. Overall, this this war is um, won by the regaining organization. 21% efficiency. Sitting at 37. Okay, we sank a convoy of Belgium. Why not? And now this is getting awfully close. Yeah. This will not help. We cannot withdraw them to there. What we can do is try to help Long Hua. Prioritized him. Usually I don't like that. But I think they need the upgrades. It may take a while though. Which I do not like either. Yeah. See? This will take a long while. Once they have it though, we might we may use them to bump somebody, so there's some usefulness in that. Wow. Okay. You can also just get in here, come to think of it. Yeah, you can. No worries. On the other hand, down here, they, they can't just penetrate here and go straight to Bangkok. Ah, I do not like this at all. Oh yeah, sure. You can stop this. And just help defend this province. With proper technology, they should hurt much more. They don't, though. 
what province is this? This one. Well, an attack was expected, right? Oh. That didn't work. Okay. Let's not forget about the United Kingdom. So somebody needs to stay here. Seriously? How long will it take you to get down here? This one's free, this one's free. No use defending this anymore. Wait... Yeah, let's go down. Or just stay here. <laughs> this doesn't seem to work. There. Does this count as, as going through a river here? Oh, this, this is HQs only. Yeah. Okay, I see. I don't want to move them back though. Let's just leave this province open. Yes, yes, thank you. Thank you very much. They should arrive pretty soon. Okay. So this combat doesn't look very promising to Japan, but it grinds them down. That's a really tough one. The garrison might lose its, its position. Sure, I deployed it in, in here, so my bad. These ones, there's reinforcements and they have a great chance to get in there. We don't. Which reminds me, shouldn't there be some sort of technology for this? Uh, where is it? Well, large formations would be fantastic, but that's not what I'm looking for. I, I think Unico operation is not bad. Yes, grand battle plan. We need that. There are four left. Four. Still trying to get in there. So, given that this doesn't seem to work, let them have a rest. Ours as well as theirs. And we will do something else down here along the way. But this province is open. So, why should we stay here? Just let's have a look. If Bangkok is available. The damn river here. Also, our militia is not really great at uh, attacking movements. It's just not their focus. What are you doing? Stop attacking. I I did instruct him to go in there previously. This is why that happened. So overall they have really great modifiers. The problem is the base equipment. How are you? At 5%, well, this will be fantastic. I could try to delay production.
I'll just get rid of some of the anti-aircraft guns. On the other hand, they are close to being finished. We got industrial capacity in Goldmond. An additional one. That will take forever to build up, will it? Yeah. That will take forever. Is it weird to argue that I prefer going through the jungle in comparison to the mountains? Feels like that's still more easy. I also have a question here. Why do we produce that much money? We are exporting a lot of energy. And we export money for supplies. But what's Tibet and Sinkyang? This is our puppet, so this is fine. And that's all the training that happens. Great. So look at it this way. Would you be inclined to... No. Would you be inclined to... No. Well, I cannot trade with CM anymore. Neither with the United Kingdom. Portugal, maybe. I would gladly buy your supplies. Hmm. Okay. That's not good. None of this is... Yeah, that's not going as expected. That give did give us a little push though over here. Two transports. That's not it just yet, but more or less. My biggest concern is that we also have a problem with the transport here. We rarely lose one of these. It's the longer routes that we, we lose. Oh, I see. I see. No big deal. Now we can get in here. Push in here, push in here for good measure. Get them to help. Bulgaria has joined the Axis, finally. Seems reasonable. These guys need to push on. Yeah, okay. And this entire army can just go down here. Probably need to push them forward a little bit. Apparently we need a uh, one a battle up here. Mm, which one? This one? Seriously? Okay. Hmm. 
It doesn't make Garrison Brigade, that will not help much. That radar will not do much either. None of them. We are getting into the upgrade territory, though. Finally. Great. Oh, that doesn't go well. Not at all. We just need Bangkok, don't we? Maybe a bit more. There's a few more victory points down here. Okay. That's in a few days. Here's transport. Not that we need it. Convoys are needed. These do their job. Same as them. Yeah, that's a lot of upgrades needed here. I think prioritize them the air. That that might be a mistake. Let them just prioritize whatever they want. Probably infantry, militia, and so on. Do the oldest first. Only we had militia divisions here. Reminds me, no, it's not there yet. The garrison brigade, great. Put it here. I should have taken more troops or better quality troops, probably more. Um, I attacked too many directions too early. <laughs> that said, the, the attrition that Japan um, gets or is, is, is exposed to up here will grind them to a halt at some point. That's reasonable. We should probably <laughs> research this and have some radar. None of this is really needed. This is needed though. We do not have submarine engineering, doesn't matter much. All of this is in development. Yeah, we need those two, right? Great. Forty nine points of research needed. Can we maybe reduce officers a little bit more? Say down to four. We're close to being at a hundred forty percent. 
will not matter much anymore. I won't die again. Seems all right too. Again, they can go in here. That should be possible. Yes, it is. Okay, okay, okay. There's infantry brigades that will be finished. We should put them towards uh, into, into Tomotai, into the Nanjing Infantry Corps. Can you just stop delivering supplies and... Oh no, you can't. Of course you can't, there's a war going on down there. Yeah. I kind of forgot about that. That's great. That gives us some practical. Which might reduce the next run of, in terms of industrial capacity a little bit. Not much though. <sighs> Is there anything that will be finished pretty soon? Anti-aircraft guns in October. Another set of anti-aircraft guns in October. Yeah, that'll help. We might also get Bangkok. That might help too. And what's going on here? 5.66. So we might, industrial capacity might go up to 174 at, one, at some point. Still sitting in here. You can probably move forward. So that one division should be done. He should probably move down here. No, it's him. The army can remain wherever it wants. Skill 5, jungle red. Not bad. What did I say? I think I said... Yeah, thank you. I think I said Nanjing Infantry Corps, so let's put them in there. One, two. N well, if they gain organization, they can fight. If they don't, they don't. Gives a combined arm, a combined arms bonus too. I think. Great. Hmm. I don't know if letting them run around all on their own is a good idea. It does feel like we should do that though. Given that there's nobody to defend this over here. 
I just regret not being, bringing the horses. Diplomacy can probably be reduced. Espionage as well. We need that research. We need it now. That will be easy. That's done. And we can strategically redeploy these. And push the, push the rest into Bangkok, really. Oh no. Development penalty? Oh, they are attacking from multiple directions. I guess this is these two. Okay. Well, the modifiers are great overall. They really are. advance in agriculture that's education that should have remained should probably push that to the top too Force down here, other than these two, they are out of range. Not a chance. I could obviously station them here, it would just feed them to the interceptors, though. Maybe. Maybe I can put them up here. Rebase them to here. And Yana. Come on. And now that they've, they are here, we can give them reserve duty. That should help for others here, namely these, not these, these, because they seem to be suffering losses. So maybe this pushes their, um, their strength at least a little bit. Okay. Well, this will take some time, will it? Just 
just an HQ and there's no troops up here. Yeah. Just an HQ that doesn't fight. I love it how they accumulate all of these traits. Okay, garrisons. Fine. Where is the garrison missing? Hong Kong? Hong Kong needs an additional garrison. Anyone else? This. And all of a sudden, coastline looks okayish. I'm not gonna say good. Okayish. Now we'll probably use additional garrisons up here, actually. So, you guys are sitting here and nothing happens? That cannot last. Get over there. To Multan, not to be confused with Mulan. Oh, our garrisons are attacked. They decided otherwise. Good decision. That's another garrison. So let's check. That's five, that's five, that's five, that's five. That two, that two. That's all good. That's 23 actually. Oh yeah, the, the HQ has garrison too. These two need uh, improvement. So that one and the one on the island. And Right, cool. Xion. Well, the ones in Golmon will be finished in October. Uh, within October, and these will be finished in six days. The ones in Lanzhou. That will not help much with the upgrades though, but it's something. The rest of it is more or less a stalemate. Well, more or less. If I look at this, the land combat experience barely moves. Especially not upwards. It should though, it definitely should. We got rid of the garrison. We seem to be winning this fight too. I still think you should win this. Mountains or no mountains. Apparently I'm the only one with that opinion though. And this is not moving over a river either. 
This is just mountainous terrain. <laughs> He's at skill level 5 now. See, please tell me, yeah, he's, a, he's the leader of the entire army, at least. So that gives bonuses to everyone. Bangkok goes down. Alright, yeah. So I guess we can do it that way too. Leave one here. Take everyone else along. Capture Lahore. You can go down here. Does not matter anymore, all of you can go here. Well, with the exception of one, maybe. In case they get some stupid ideas. Hundred seventy-five. See, as I promised. Finally got finished. We have won the Battle of Bangkok. That's great. Get in there. Ah, uh, so close. Well, next victory point is down here. In February. <laughs> I guess I could have done that with spies. We can probably keep that running. We will need it anyway. All of this stuff. So much research. You can probably stay out. Held here. Or just remain here. Does it matter? Get over there. All of you. Well, in fact, in including him. There are, there's no port in Bangkok. Okay. Great. No technological revolution this episode. That should settle the need for garrisons. Five, 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 and one. So garrisons in Indochina are a thing now. We should probably do that too. They don't get any supplies though. And now we might just have some industrial capacity for upgrades after all. Move. Finally. This doesn't seem very lucky so far. Militia. Oh, come on, seriously? At full organization. Never mind. Let's not do that. What's going on in Europe? No war between them and anyone else yet. Oh, Bulgaria, finally. 
started to attack Yugoslavia. Yes. <laughs> well. Good luck to you, Bulgaria. That should be finished pretty soon. That's it. They should have done that like five years ago. What's this? Oh, they are attacking the garrison. Hmm. This is a lot closer than I want it to be. Shouldn't have a chance there. Why do they suffer so much damage? Ouch. Do we still have the air support here? Uh, I guess this one. Stop resting. Bump them. Come on, stop resting. I don't get there. Okay. Well, at least we reinforced all of the ports in nationalist China. There's, I, I guess one could argue, there's some growth here. So that's fine. I do not know if we will encounter any divisions down here. On the other hand, it's barely worth worrying about, is it? We'll get there and we will conquer everything. This guy doesn't have any opposition either. So maybe we can go all the way to Karachi. And afterwards, well, there's there's some provinces of Pakistan left. We'll probably conquer all of all of India first before we le release any puppets. Just push garrisons down here. That will take forever. We cannot deploy them there. And I will definitely not ship them around here. This is like <laughs> suicide mission, I think. To ship them down there. Yeah, so at least we got Bangkok, and Siam will fall. It will not take much longer. So that's it for today's episode. Let's wrap this up. Next time we will take Siam, and next time we will probably have a better time against Japan, given that the upgrades are coming in. Slowly but steadily. It, it, this is really a grind, so it may take a long time. That said, we, we do have some progress here and we will probably push into uh, the united kingdom's territories in the next episode and just um, put some pressure on the whole of india so that might also cost them some victory points but more importantly um, it deducts from their attention in europe it will avoid um, them like starting some invasion or something i cannot give for a guarantee for the americans though the americans are always dangerous so yeah i'll see you all next time yeah thank you very much for watching